reasons why everyone should be armed, especially in their home, and especially uh, seniors or our most valued citizens. Here's an example, recent example, November 7th, 9.30 in the evening uh, in Tamarack, Florida, which is in Broward County, near Miami area. Uh, a gentleman, 70 years old, <clears throat> Bill Norkunas, is on the phone with dispatch, correction, 911, not dispatch, 911, <laughs> saying, a guy is trying to break into my house. Now, Bill just got out of the shower. He was naked. <laughs> he was naked. His security camera was telling him there's a guy at his front door trying to break in with a brick, wailing on his door, trying to break in. <clears throat> now, Nokunas is on the phone with 911. Now, remember this 70 year old guy naked, just got out of the shower, <clears throat> bad guy, literally trying to bash his way into his house. They don't know each other, by the way. And he's, a, and Nokunas is on the phone for 15 minutes saying, guy's trying to break into my house. And then he says on, on the 911, I pointed my gun through the glass at his face. And he still kept bashing away. And then I told him, go away or I'll shoot you. Oh, by the way, No Kunis was also naked out of the shower and on crutches at seven years old. Seven zero. Uh, the only reason the bad guy never made it through is because No Kunis had installed hurricane resistant glass on his doors and his windows. So it's like safety glass on steroids. If you've lived in Florida, you know what that stuff looks like. For 15 minutes, he is literally on the phone with 911. Uh, where are the de where where is the cops? Crickets. Crickets. Neighbors were calling 911 as well because they were witnessing the break in. Um <laughs> Here's what the sheriff's office is. This is Broward County Sheriff. Within days of the incident, the Broward Sheriff's Office began a thorough review into how the deputies on scene handled, first of all, it took them 15 minutes to get on scene, handled the response to this, here's bullshit words, fluid and rapidly evolving situation. Fuck that. Old cripple guy in his house, on the phone, 15 minutes. Explain to me why the cops think that's a rapidly evolved. Get in your ride, go lights and sirens, and drive. What the hell were they doing? What the hell were they doing? Because I'll tell you, if somebody said there is a mass shooting at the mall or at a school, they would roll. They might not go into school if you remember Broward County. But, hey. Uh... <clears throat> A typical round words. The review is ongoing. They finally found the guy. I don't know how. He's 23 years old. 23 years old. Uh, and what does Mr. Nokunas say? The 70 year old naked cripple guy? Never depend on 911. Never depend on the cops to show up. Have a backup plan. What is the backup plan? The backup plan is be armed and know how to use it. Jeez. I keep saying, nobody's coming. The cops are minutes away when seconds count. Anyway, I thought you'd enjoy this little reminder about why we have our Second Amendment.
it is for defense and why everyone should be armed even in your home so with that uh, don't forget subscribe click the bell like if you like share and as always thanks for watching <laughs> carry on <laughs>